Do you know what hypothermia is and how to recognize its symptoms? It's an abnormally low body core temperature that can occur due to exposure to a cold environment. And when you're out there in the great outdoors, it's crucial to know the warning signs. In the case of mild hypothermia, core body temperatures drop below 95 degrees Fahrenheit. The person may feel cold and will likely be shivering intensely. They should still maintain normal consciousness and coordination, but as the temperature dips below 93 degrees Fahrenheit, symptoms can escalate. Slurred speech, memory loss, poor judgment and carelessness may set in. In such situations, the first step is to move the person to a sheltered environment. Wet clothing should be replaced with dry, insulated garments. Warm food and sugary hot fluids can help raise the core temperature. To slow heat loss, use a sleeping bag or other insulating materials. Avoid hot water bottles, instead consider steam inhalation or building a fire. When core body temperatures fall below 90 degrees Fahrenheit, we're dealing with profound hypothermia. Symptoms now include weakness, lethargy, an altered mental state and eventually a complete cessation of shivering. In these cases, handle the person gently to avoid heart failure. Place them in a sleeping bag or cover them with blankets to prevent further cooling. A person with an altered mental state should not eat or drink to prevent choking or vomiting. It's time to evacuate to a hospital for professional rewarming. A simple sobriety test can also help gauge hypothermia. Try having the person walk a straight line heel to toe. If they're unable to do so, it's likely that the hypothermia has progressed to the profound stage. And remember, if a profoundly hypothermic person is showing no signs of life, don't assume the worst. Handle them gently to avoid heart failure. If no signs of life are detected after one minute, the best course of action depends on the situation. If you're alone or with one other person, cover and shelter the person, then seek help. If there are multiple rescuers and it's safe to stay, begin CPR while at least two rescuers seek help. If the person is easily transportable, evacuate with an improvised stretcher while performing CPR. A crucial thing to remember is to never assume a person is dead until thoroughly warmed. In rare cases, individuals without detectable signs of life may recover when rewarmed. Hypothermia is a silent, creeping danger, but with proper recognition and treatment, it doesn't have to be a fatal one. Stay safe out there.